Hey everybody, what's up? Madman here, welcome back to another exciting episode of Sid Meier's Civilization Revolution. And we're still building the Manhattan Project in the Athens, not Thebes, that's Egypt. Uh, we got a cruiser, game's just loading up. Alright, we got the cruiser, we're building a navy there, we got riflemen there, we got a tank there. And man, project, alright. Let's continue moving forward. And now we have the Glory. secrets of flight. Oh. And I'm just going to stand here, for, I'm just going to hold this camera angle for a few more seconds so you guys can take a look at the curvy pencils that mentioned in the last episode just to drive everybody mad. Alright, that's enough. Alright, now we got flight. Strabo. Now we have a uh, plane's Strabo. built. How are, well, I was just about to say how we have the power of flight before we have power of electricity, but... Wait, no, did Edison discover electricity before the, uh, the Wright brothers started flying? I don't know, it's been a while. Uh... Corporation or public broadcasting? Nah, we're good. Steel, the automobile, advanced flight, nuclear power. Yeah, let's get advanced flight. I think that's what leads to the space program. No. First of all, you're on the other side of the planet. Yes, I know about flight, wise man. Okay, I'm at war with Rome. And, okay, Cleopatra. Yes, let's have peace. Yes, we have peace. Who am I at war with? I'm at war with everybody except I'm, uh, I'm at war with uh, Saladin, but that's it. Wait. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, that's all five. I thought there was another. Okay. Awesome. Just start building up defenses. Karl Marx, uh, founder of com is that the same one I'm thinking of? Founder of communism. Uh, hmm. Yeah. You know what? We'll have him settle there. We'll start pumping out more culture. So at this point, I really don't want to have to do a lot of wars. Okay, but now we got advanced flight. Bomber built in Athens. Okay. You know what? Get mass production. Yes, I, yes, I know about bombers. I know about flights. I just don't like using planes because, well, you gotta get them back to the city to refuel. So I'm not giving you a damn thing, man. Okay, there we go. You know, build a cathedral. Just build something that'll give you guys something to do. Building that. Building a cruiser. Perfect. Once we get a new start going, we'll start working well. Once we get this, that working, we'll start working well. Great English, Jordan. Uh, I mean, Madman. Oh, well. You should know my first name by now. If not, well, now you do. All right, now we got, yeah, modern infantry. Okay. I think we need steel. I'm trying to figure out how to do space flight again. All right. We got tank army. Got that. That's... Close to building that, you'll be able to get cathedral. You don't need to build any more tanks. You got an army there. You know what? Build a courthouse. Get that. Defend our waters. Egyptians have placed democracy. Okay. Okay, now we have steel. We now a battleship. You know what, yeah, let's get mass media. We'll build Hollywood, and then... <laughs> then Beijing's uh, Great Wall there can't, uh... Can't keep our, uh... Keep our culture out. Because that's what that is. That is literally the Great Wall. Or, no, that's just a regular wall. Huh. Usually Beijing is just, in these games usually build the Great Wall there, because it blocks out all that. And, wow, Rome is really doing some massive expansion. So, Rome and I, so Rome and I are clearly going to start clashing heads at any moment, because he's going to start giving me BS saying, we need control... Of all this, and I'm just be like, well, I was here. Ew. Oh, you know what? Moving on. Oh, so I didn't actually deploy something. No, okay. Excuse me, a second. We're still at war with them, right? Okay. Besides the barbarians, I think that was the first time we've actually had actual combat with another civilization. Strabo. 
Now we have mass media. Also, it's increased the population. And fun fact, mass media was originally what I was pursuing in college. And we'll get electricity. Build a library. Next turn, wow. Awesome. Alright, let the cultural expansion begin! Why am I saying begin? It's actually happening all right now. Alright, you got a library, build a university. And nope, we're good, let's move on. It's 1972. That 70s show. And now we have electricity. Now we uh, let's get electronics. Aqueduct. Okay, now we have aqueducts. Now we have aqueducts in all our cities. Didn't have to. Re didn't have to build it. It just happened. Boom. Okay, hold on a sec. Let me get my one uh, cruiser here. All right. Actually, I got an idea. Get that one right over there. Get you over there. You over there, form a fleet, and we'll put you right over here. Cause I have a feeling something's coming. Don't no, stop asking for shit. I'm not gonna give you anything. And now we just <laughs> exalted one. Our wise men have discovered the secrets of electronics. <laughs> to trade in each city. <laughs> Networking, and then we will build the internet. Where that totally won't be filled with idiots and trolls and everything. It'll be a land of peace. Spreading technology! Do you really believe what I'm saying is the truth? And we have a cathedral built in roads. And I think we get banks next or something. Uh, you know what? Start building some wonders. Yeah, the Magna Carta. Then our courthouses will produce a culture. And oh, you don't do that anymore. We don't. Wait, what do you have? Okay, you got. No, no, no. Build some modern infantry. I used to call it modern day infantry, like modern warfare. Chinese you discover the ancient artifact of. Uh, I have no idea what that does. Roads replace Athens, the world's greatest. Yep. So the adrenaline in our soul is truly f flourishing. Dang -o -dang. Uh, game? Game. And... Uh, Maricone? I think his Maricone is the last name. I can't pronounce this first. Complete study networking? Uh, let me think about that. I got an idea. You just stay right there for now. I mean, we got so much... <laughs> They pulled right up to university costs fifty percent. You know, let's get the automobile. Okay. Yeah, get that factory going. Still doing that. Still doing that. And if I give you the printing press, will you go away? I try to give him the printing press, folks. I, I actually at one point was not planning to give him any pieces of technology, but I was thinking maybe just so we stop with annoyances. But sorry, gotta go. I mean, technically, I'm still a tribal chief, so can that constitute as a small and splash? Stay there. Put you there. Yeah, maybe we can finish this uh, run in this episode, because I actually do have to talk about something at the end. Very important, so stay for the end, folks. Now we have the power of the automobile. Space flight, that's what I was looking for. And in the meantime, he discovered space flight. Now we can start building stuff and go straight to space. The entire world has been revealed to us. I'm not gonna lie, that reminds me of a lot of when you first discover the space technology. It gives you the full concept of seeing everything. It reminds me from Command and Conquer Red Alert with the at least for the Allies, with the Allies 
uh, you get the Jeep, you build the techn technology center, and then, what? Oh, wow, damn. Capital City is doing actually pretty good. Wait, what was it? Hold on one second. Yeah, uh, no, 10. Uh, so it's doing a little bit better than a round. Well, I mean, Beijing's only, uh, so they're doing a little bit better, well, compared to. <clears throat> but yeah, so yeah, you build the technology center and command and conquer red alert for the allies. And then after time, the GPS gets launched and reveals the whole world. Until you lose power, and then the moment you lose power, you lose sight of that. But I think if once you regain power, you don't have to rebuild it. Okay, 1992. <laughs> okay. We already... Uh, I don't think anybody else is going for the nuke. But let's build a superconductor just so we can build the SDI. In case anybody else gets the nuke first. And now my people are sophisticated. Do that. Okay. You build. Yeah, build Hollywood. Oh no. Building Magna Carta. You're getting a factory. You're getting that done. You, I had no use for that galleon. Surely the potential snobbery of people will be soon coming in. Okay, is this where everybody starts declaring war on me because they realize I'm going for the space race? Probably. Okay. It's the year 2000. And now we have the Magna Carta, where now courthouse is with gross culture. And we love King Day, has been declared in Stroman. We love the King Day, has been pronounced in Shenyang. I think I mispronounced that. Alright. Alright, let's start producing, let's start building all the, uh, you know what? There we go. Start building that. You build life support. Uh, let's have you just build the nuke just in case. You know, we don't need Hollywood anymore. We're leaving. Alright, we did habitation. We did. Let's get fuel going. Alright, let's start building some spaceship parts. After all, we're going to the last place. Oh. Okay, we love the King Day and City Roads. But no, ladies and gentlemen, since I brought up Command and Conquer earlier, we're now going to the one place where all the rest of the where all the rest of the people can't reach us. Space. Superconductor, let me get I get one. Built. Yep, and now it's alright. Go. Let's get the corporation. And do this again. Same spot, too. You know what? Can we just... Yeah. Just make it easier for us. Alright. Oh, wait. Is, this sh is it going to be shot in the space now? First landing. Oh, no. We got... Uh, let me guess. We were the first one. Is anyone researching anything first in this game, landing. or is it just us? <laughs> Alright. Nuclear power. <laughs> Albert Schwartz. Oh. Can we skip? Skip. Thank you. Otherwise, we're going to be here all day for this. There we go. First port. First piece. Yep. To Alpha Centauri. And totally calling this Prometheus won't, you know, totally sink us. Because I forgot the... What was it? Nostrom? Nostrom? Nostrom. What was it in Alien? I forgot. It's been a while since I've seen Alien, actually. Let's see, we did that. We did build another habitation pod. Building Manhattan Project. You're building fuel. You're doing that. After one, two. All right. Let's keep this going. Just add one population to each city. Ah. Take a sip. You're the one who keeps sending galleons my way, dude. And now we have nuclear power. Keep production in each city. Oh man, Command and Conquer Red Alert 2, the nuclear power plant. Man, that gave so much power. But if it ever got destroyed, it was like a nuke going off. I'm trying to avoid communism as much as I can, folks. God. Now 
next. The, oh. Yikes, the vastly discreet Arabs has convinced the disgusting Syracuse to join their civilization. Oh, so Americans were around here? Alright, more fuel. Doing that, you're doing that. Awesome. Pretty much everybody had the same idea. Let's just go for economics and technology. Now we have the secrets of globalization. 500 gold pieces, alright. Yeah, we're just gonna invest in future technology. And we have another great person. Please tell me what this great person does. Oh, it's a... It's a it's can we just settle in there? You know what? Complete future technology. Let's just get it out of the way. What's our future technology? I think for future technology in this game, it alternates between, like, more science, more production. It's just, they're just like, you got to the end of the line of discovering technology. There's not much else we can need to do. And we have a great artist, too. Game. Charles Babbage. More fuel from Stroman. I'm gonna get demonetized for looking at this, right? I mean... Uh... Yeah, I, I, I think we'll be fine. <laughs> you know what, let's, uh, let's, uh... <laughs> let's build another fuel real quick so we, uh... Uh, don't, uh... Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, settle in Athens. We'll pump up more culture. Game. And Frederick Douglass. And we have more We Love the King Day. Game. I like my control space. And now we have the Manon Project. We have a nuke. And we're just gonna, yeah, wait here. And you know what? Settle him in there. Set, yeah. For more population. Whoa, whoa. No, 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 no. How long does it take you to build a life support system? Two turns. Okay, you're actually really chugging it around. Actually, you know what? What if I just put you straight on production? We don't need anything else. Two turns. A whole one turn. Do that. Alright. You know what? Yeah. Put you on production as well. Everybody get to work. We want to get off this planet. In the words of King Arthur, you're right. <laughs> oh, it's like let's not. Tis a silly place. There we go. Now it looks like Gamera. 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 Gamera is really neat. He is filled with turtle meat. We've been eating Gamera. Cute. I'm pretty sure I botched those lyrics, but meh. Woofo. Alright, so now we have full life. So we just need two more fuel. Uh, I think four propulsion and two more of everything. Okay, so but yeah, let's get the propulsion working. Cute. We're doing fuel next. We're doing habitation. We're doing habitation. You're doing propulsion. All right. I love the fact that at this point, no one's declared all this war on me. I may have spoken too soon. Nope, they haven't declared war on me. There we go. <laughs> We're no longer out of the uh, demonization zone. <laughs> Oh. Start building fuel. <laughs> Again, you're the one who's sending it to me. You don't have to... Wait, was he saying that I had no need for that galleon, even though I didn't destroy it yet? You know what? I actually want to see what he will actually do. So you know what? I'll... I won't attack. 
I will extend an olive branch from space. Let's see, it's 10,000 colonists at arrival. It'll be 10,000. Oh. Alright. There we go. Let's just keep building stuff. Okay, there's the final fuel. Okay, so let's see here. We got. Let's start working on propulsion. Propulsion. You're doing the habitation finally. All right, all right. Let's do propulsion. Oh no. You know what? Let's see. Just to speed this up. Cha Ching. Cha Ching. Here comes the money. Money, 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 money. Wow. I never thought I'd do a Shane McMahon reference. Hmm. Yeah, the best part about doing that reference is I didn't have to do a 40 foot drop onto somebody. I think we're officially maxed out. So we've got the four fuel pods, four propulsion. Oh no, we still have room for one more habitation module. Which is right there! There we go. We got a fully, fully equipped uh, space station. No strom. What is it? No stromo? Per you know, let's just go with Prometheus since that's the one ship I actually remember well. Alright, let's fly! Spread your wings and fly. I better not hear, ab hear about a space mutiny while I'm back here on Earth. Otherwise, we'll, we'll send blast hard cheese. Everybody else, if you know what I'm referencing, please write all their names in the comments down below. Okay. Now, we got that going. We got that going. Okay, you know what? I just thought of something incredibly stupid. Okay, here's the thing though. If, I, if we all know it's gonna be incredibly stupid. Yep, I'm gonna make a save here because, again, it's gonna be incredibly stupid. It's gonna be absolutely worthless. It's gonna be an absolute waste of resources, but it's me, folks. So, okay, let's just get this. Uh, no, 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 not him. Alright. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you might wanna get out of there. Thank you. You ever seen a waste of a nuke before, folks? Uh. Yeah. Ah, oh, son of a bitch! You are so lucky. I was literally gonna launch a nuke, but I've been I've been destroyed by bureaucracy and red tape. Okay. Uh, okay, not to be this person, uh, Saladin. I, oh, well, first of all, future technology. Thank you. What should we build in Athens? You know what? Just start plugging out wonders. Yeah, you build Hollywood. What should we build in the city of Rhodes? Uh, let's build the internet. You work on the space program. But you know what, Saladin? Has anyone ever told you don't poke the bear? Because you know what? I give you peace. You know what? No. I'm still going to be the bigger man. I could have launched a nuke at you, but I was I was set back by the Senate. I could have destroyed you with a battleship. So you know what? I'm 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 just going to I'm I'm going to be the bigger man. Uh, we're not Aristotle. Uh, no, we don't need You know what? Yeah. Get him over there. Aristotle. Yeah, just yeah, just hang out there. Your full dreams and something like beware your nuclear weapons would bring worldwide contamination. Or, or contamination. Why do you think I'm leaving? Oh. 
You know what? Let them come. Okay, let's see here. Actually, let's uh yeah, let's see what this does. Take it as a sign, mate. Take it as a sign. The SSS user, or SS Madman, has arrived at Alpha Centauri in the year 2044. So in 20 more years, folks, I would have led our people to a whole new world. But knowing my luck, how I run things, it would have probably would have turned into space mutiny. Okay, game. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. Yes, so that's it, folks. Saladin came in second? How is that possible? Well, I won a technological victory. Thank you, great wise man. Who I just realized you had pencils in your pocket, too. The curved pencils still continue. Okay, and before everyone says, yes, I know I was playing this on Chieftain, the easiest level ever, so yes, I know that, but it was it was honestly pretty fun to play again. And I think I didn't get any trophies for doing that, because I should have gotten something saying, oh, hey, you, you got the trophy of the Greeks. But then again, this is like, I'm streaming this uh, PS3 game, I'm streaming it on the PS5, so I don't know, it's a whole weird thing. But alright, yes, we won a technological victory as... On chieftain difficulty with the Greeks. So, uh, next we'll either go after economic victory or domination victory or economic domination and culture. So, you know what? I'll let you guys vote on that down in the comments too, what I should do as well. As well as also, if you guys want to throw down what civilization you want me to do, throw that in there as well. But yes, all right, guys. So, yeah, this has been an, an extra long episode, but let me explain to you guys why. So, tomorrow, because today is Monday. Tomorrow will be officially the first day of my new job, which I'm actually a little excited for because it's a whole new career. It's a whole new, it's even though it's something I've done, it's a whole new company, it's a whole new organization, and they're really well structured, and I really want to see where this goes. So, so yeah, so because of that, ladies and gentlemen, I officially am no longer doing uploads on Fridays. I'm only going to do one upload, and that is on Monday. I don't have a specific time, but it just be, you know, like around between 3 and 6 p.m. Monday Eastern is probably when you're going to get the episode. So you're only going to. So I just went from every other day now to a weekly upload, ladies and gentlemen. But you know what? That should help out with the schedule. Plus, I can always film on the, the weekends and upload it so I can focus on my job, but at the same time still provide content for you guys. Plus, you guys get a whole week to watch a video, especially if it's another extended episode uh, like this. But you know what? I really, really wanted to go to space. After all, we were just so close right there anyway, so why not? <laughs> so, everybody, thank you very much for watching. Greatly appreciate it. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe because we will keep doing this. I have started seeing our viewership going up as well as the like, likes going up as well. As well as, I love reading the comments. I will respond to the comments as well as also I'm, I'm definitely having fun doing this, guys, again. That's, that's, that's what I really wanted to have this do is I really wanted to have fun with this. I didn't want to see this as a form of work or become you know excruciating or painful and don't want to drop my controller i just didn't i didn't want video games to come that to the point where i didn't want to play any more games but you know what now this is actually really fun and i want to continue doing this again so you guys you guys keep going with the the views the likes and comments and you guys are definitely continuing the dream and i want to keep doing that so yes yeah, so that's the big announcement i start work tomorrow and mondays are going to be my only up update uh upload day for the uh, demo GoGo pilot that I released a couple days ago, I'm thinking that maybe maybe be like a 
a once a month video and I'll only upload it on Wednesday. So it'll be like a once a month thing. I don't have a real set date for those. Like I said, it's a pilot. And if you guys want to see more, go check that out and whatnot. <laughs> All right, everybody. Again, thank you very much for watching. I'm the Madman. I'll see you guys next time for more. Later.